So the next line of enhancements in 2018 is, well, the touch mode. Um, in, in 2018, the touch mode enables users to seamlessly use, uh, use SOLIDWORKS in their touch-enabled devices in order to, well, manipulate their designs and create new ones. Now, in order to activate the touch mode, all you need to do is go into the view menu and grab the touch mode button. Now, as soon as you do that, you can disconnect any auxiliary device that con that's connected to your touch-enabled device. And, well, the user interface updates to have a couple of commands that helps you seamlessly um, operate well your designs. Well, the first set of commands you'll notice is a quick access toolbar. Now, from the quick access toolbar, you have a set of menus that you can use to make modifications, reorient your design, and so on and so forth. Now, let's say we wanted to, um, uh, let's say we wanted to check the clearance on the little shelf and the, 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 the dishwasher. So here, what we're trying to do is we're actually trying to check the clearance using the clearance detection tool um, between the drawer and the, um, the dishwasher. Now moving on, now let's say um, you'd like to use your mouse gestures. Now with touch-enabled devices, all you need to do is do a little swipe, and that gives you access to the menus in your mouse gestures. Here, what we're going to do is we're going to use the zoom command from your mouse gestures in order to zoom into a design that we're about to modify, which is this little tap. Now in order to modify the tap, all you need to do is, well, tap on it. And uh, as, soon as, you, as soon as you tap the tap, uh, your uh, frequently used commands show up, and what's really interesting about this is that in your touch mode, these frequently used commands have larger icons, so you don't miss the button that you'd like to hit. Now here, what we're about to do is we're about to change the configuration of the tap to, well, a larger tap. Now, the, the last line of enhancements with the touch mode is the touch sketching. Now, napkin sketching has been the foundation of engineering design since time immemorial. So now we've, br we've brought in the, this napkin sketching capability with your touch mode with, um, and your touch-enabled devices in SOLIDWORKS 2018. Now, what this enables users to do is, as soon as you activate your touch mode and you get into a sketch, your command manager updates to have the Sketch Ink tab. Now, once you get into the Sketch Ink tab, what you can do is you can actually grab the color of your stylus and even the size. Now, once you have both of those selected, all you need to do is grab your stylus and start making pen strokes on the screen. Now, once you start making these pen, stro pen strokes, um, the software has the intelligence to identify the closest parametric shape to any stroke you make. So, you know, you, you do a little squiggly line and that actually turns into a straight line. The big benefit behind this is that as you're doing these napkin sketches, you can actually auto-convert them to sketch entities. Now, the interesting part about that is that if you actually connect the endpoints of these sketch entities, they automatically add a relationship to them. So you don't have to manually add a relationship between sketch endpoints.